So this guy is a wanted man, and he calls himself Toronto's Joker. And one day, Toronto's Joker decides to set a trailer ablaze for a TikTok video. And police show up, cause you know, that's illegal, and he flees the scene. So police chase him, and they chase him, and they chase him, and he's in this high-speed chase for around an hour and a half. And then suddenly, boom! His tires go out, cause police had thrown down one of those spike strips. So he gets arrested, convicted, and he goes to prison for a couple years. So he gets out and like immediately breaches his statutory release, which is kind of like violating your parole. So then he's on the run again and police can't find him. And they put out his mugshot to the public to see if the public can help. And that mugshot goes viral. You're telling me that this man right here with every single tattoo on his face is escaping the authorities. And finally, after a month of being on the run, Toronto's Joker just happens to be checking himself into a hospital and a nurse recognizes him, calls the police, and he's arrested again. Oh, but it gets worse. He does more time, he's in a halfway house, and he allegedly leaves the house.